everyone, we're back. We're gonna go see the Empress now. And I'm gonna give her a piece of my brain. We have a fire CPU chip. A firewall, if you will. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. That's probably the joke. Um. I just swam through lava. This game just gets better and better. And we're gonna save. He me cause Paris. I'm low. Ominous. Hey, Amy! I bet that Simiko looks like that freaky shot in his brain or something. <laughs> Security here was pretty tight, but nothing we couldn't handle. Yeah, you tell her, Amy! Benevolent Amaterasu. I have been waiting for you. And soon the traveling artist. You too, of course. Hey, how'd you know our names? Hey, anyway, first things first. You knew about that funky mist and wa the water dragon, didn't you? You've got some explaining to do. Tell us what you're up to. <laughs> My people. My poor people, their suffering torments me. Sickened by this mist and terrorized by the water dragon. The cries of their pain wash over me like a torrent. Crying sounds. We know what's going on. You're, you're tormenting the people of this city. You must be a monster feeding off the ill will to jet ill will it generates. Now stop stalling and raise this grimy old curtain. Come on! Show yourself, you old hag! Uh-oh. Is soon. Your words are very harsh. But you are right. It was rude of me to hide my face from you. Benevolent Amaterasu, I, Hibiko, the ruler of Saiyan City, offer my most sincere apologies. Queen of Sand City, Himeko! Wasted. <clears throat> As ruler, I can't stand by and watch my people suffer. I, Himeko, will not allow this evil to darken sand. My prayers will not cease until we are rid of this curse. Until I have located the, ha the hateful monster stronghold, Oni Island. What's this about a monster stronghold? Are you saying that that's... Are you saying that's the source of your city's problems? <clears throat> Can't say I've ever heard of Oni Island or whatever you call it. And what do you mean you're trying to locate the island? I mean, it's an island, right? It couldn't have just floated away. Oni Island is elusive. It literally could have just floated away. It vanishes each day at sundown, shifting to a new location. That's bullshit! No one knows where in the vast wide ocean it will reappear. So even if I wanted to dispatch an army there, 
it would never arrive. <clears throat> you don't say. Still, why'd you stay cooped up in this room all day long? I mean, what good will it do to simply pray day in and day out? <clears throat> She's trying to mess with us? This is the treasured crystal ball of Wak fucking Boo. My family, the, ya the Yamatai clan, has ruled Saiyan City forever. This crystal ball has been passed down through the generations. I can foresee the future in it. <clears throat> it told me you were coming. And it will tell me where in the Oceanone Island will appear next. Interesting. <clears throat> you could find only island in a jiffy with that thing. Exposing a stronghold like Oni Island demands much holy power. But if our enemies knew about my prayers, <clears throat> they would stop at nothing to prevent me in my mission. <clears throat> that is why I have locked myself away. Prayers are our only hope. But the spearhead of the enemy's forces may already be on its way. Heh, <laughs> that's a pretty good story, Queenie. But I'll go along with it. I mean, what the heck? I'd do anything for a pretty lady. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <coughs> Thanks for the warning. Be careful, you cannot approach me now. By taking this crystal ball in my hand, uh, a powerful magical barrier is erected to dispel any misfortune. You will be struck down by divine forces if you try to approach. This crystal ball ensures my safety. Even if my enemies learn of my prayers, the barrier will protect me from their attacks. Okay. Uh, will you hear my request? The request of all my people. Uh, I guess so. The mighty water dragon now threatens the peace of the oceans. I don't know why it has suddenly turned to savagery. The water dragon is a sea god whose task is to maintain order. So though it may cause harm, we invite chaos if we try to slay it. In fact, without the water dragon, Ona Island is beyond our reach. What the heck's that supposed to mean? Quit beating around the bush to spin out! <coughs> <coughs> key to reaching Ona Island lies with the water dragon. <laughs> Given that the crystal ball shows me the location of the island, the island's powerful shield will prevent us from reaching it. Any attempt to break the shield will only result in our, in our own pain. But the water dragon could break the shield with ease. It could form a bridge over the sea to the island. So you're saying that you'll reveal the ocean's lo location of Lonely Island, and the water dragon will break the barrier around it. Is that the only way to get into the enemy stronghold? But what about the water dragon? It's out of control, right? I seriously doubt it'll be happy to help us. That, that is why I must ask for your help, Amaterasu. Your powers could call on the water dragon and help it, and get it to help us. I gotta leave this palace, for my prayers require all my energy. You're the only one who could take on this important task. You gotta be kidding me. Got it! Let me guess, we use the calming, uh, mist? <clears throat> Wait, Hamaturasu! You cannot leave first without giving me your answer. Will you grab my request, the request of all my people? What, uh, I mean, I thought I did. Oh, uh, yeah. Cool. 
There's a race which controls the water dragon. They live in the sea, great sea beyond the border in the Dragonia domain. They have some connection with the dragon's recent behavior. Please come the water dragon and open the path to Only Island. Got it! Now look at the mess you've gotten us into, Furbo! Well, at least we know who's been controlling that water dragon. Let's go pay the Dragonian domain a visit. Yes. Let's. And let's give my fucking voice a rest. This way? I know this is the Emperor's Palace. Whoops. Mistakes were made. Sweet! The curse zone vanished along with the funky mist. Looks like the city's come back to life. Got me bet you never saw a happening place like this in like like this a hundred years ago. This must be exciting for you all being from the country and all. Now I know you want to just have fun, but don't go overboard. I mean I don't want you to forget what you're supposed to be doing. Yep. And let's go do what we're supposed to be doing. Oh, 
I'm guessing we go this way? What is it, pup? You want to cross the border? Well, I have to speak to my colleague, the Queen. Uh, hey, that's the border. Can a permit from Queen Ibuka for crossing the border? What on earth are you doing with something like that? Rules and rules. Anyone bearing that is allowed to pass here. You must be on some very important business, I suppose. I'll open the gate straight away. Yeah. Thank you. At ease. Bitch. Northern Yoshima Coist. Coist. Now then, where's this Dragonian domain? Sounds like something that might be under the sea. But I'd rather not. Oh, fuck, I skipped it. And it's not because I'm afraid of that pesky water dragon. It's just you swim so slow that you practically put me to sleep. Yep. Bonjour, Materasu. I trust you enjoyed your little adventure through that hole. The city's air yeah, sure cleared up thanks to you. Just ignore him and maybe he'll go away. Come on, Emmy. Why so grumpy today? Didn't you notice the view? It used to be one big cursed zone out here. But you're t tr truly pulled off one of those great divine interventions. What? I really wanted to wait for you two, but I couldn't stand leaving the sea in such a cursed state. Ah, the sea off Ryoshima coast is back to its beautiful self. Is this what they meant by prettier than picture, my little friend? What was that supposed to mean, you pretty boy? Oh, just a little something I overheard somewhere. So, my little bouncing friend, you're a wandering artist now. I want to see how beautiful your paintings are. Just one would be fine. Pretty please. Ah! My art's none of your business! Why should I show you anyway? are in a bad mood today. You're not one of those imposters who claims to be an artist but could not paint a picture if his life depended on it, are you? What? Oh, nothing. It is just something an old, some old man mentioned. His grandson, who was also his apprentice, ran away from home. And he took the old man's painting of the wood spirit with him. Do you think he might claim to have painted that that masterpiece? I mean, there are so many unscrupulous people out there. Sometimes it is hard to spot an imposter in the wide world of art. But you wouldn't know anything about that, would you? I oh Jesus. Oh, oh no. The plot thickens. I don't know what the heck you're talking about. Now make like a tree and leave. Or you can stick around if you'd rather get sliced and diced. <coughs> oh. Excuse him, more. You don't have to get so all hot under the collar. It would appear I have struck a raw nerve. Well, since I have no prophecies or anything for you this time, I suppose I'll just be on my merry way. Au revoir, baby. Ass. All right. Nose. Right, that was the wrong one. Whoa. 
Whoa. Hello. Why do I have so much yen? Am I supposed to be buying things? Okay. So Isun might be an imposter. Got it. Is that only island over there with its uh face? It's grumpy. I just love the smell of seafood. Oh. Uh, cat people! Cat people! Oh, you're welcome. Happy to see anyone in here at the moment, even a dog. We just, we just aren't any fresh fish available these days. We've hardly got any customers at all. We're well known for our chef, Mr. Umi's fresh fish dishes. I hope you'll get to try one of them. Cat people. Goodness gracious, whatever would I do? Even I, the great chef, Umi, can't cook without ingredients. I'm at the end of my rope! Cyclone Chef Umi. Listen, doggy! Can I bend? Can I bend you? Can I bend your furry little ear? There's no good fish here lately, and I can't cook without fish. I feel like I'm starting to lose my touch. I've had enough. There's gotta be something around here that'll make a good meal. Hey, what are you looking at? Oh uh, no, it'd be too much effort getting all that fur off you. I need some juicy fruits of the sea to show what I can do. And they must be fresh. It's an insult to the sea. It's an insult to the sea and the fish if the dish goes wrong. Now, I don't know what... I don't know what the story is with the water dragon. But I do know that the fish I need aren't being caught. Still, I've asked the fishermen. I can't do any more than that. Guess all I can do is sit tight and wait for good news. Sigh. Ah. Uh. That looks like an ability. That back there looks like a brush technique. I'm coming back here. Post, uh... Post water dragon. Yes, that's a great idea. That would sell like hotcakes. A donut in the shape of Oni Island. A do a doy a, a doni nut. It'll be great. Look, you can see Oni Island from here. This is the perfect spot to sell Oni Island merchandise. Gotta make the best of a bad deal, right? Or you wind up miserable. That demon-shaped island appeared out of nowhere a while ago. When the water dragon went crazy and the city got that weird fog. Well, it's happened since that island turned up. And every day, it looks like it's a different in a different place, too. There can't be a weirder sight anywhere in the world. Oh, the island, eh? I bet it's gonna be tough getting over there. And once we're there, I bet we'll wish we never did. What are you muttering about? It's time to live, liven up and do some business. You on shop a duty pooch, then take a look. I was in Mario Brothers. Okay. 
I'll just uh, buy the whole fucking store then, I guess. Okay. face I know. It's been a while, Poochie. Hey, you're that apple guy who was over by the big drawbridge. We didn't see you in the city. What are you doing here? Well, I've had a complete change of heart since then. I gave up my old job and set off my journey to hone my skills. This suits me much better than my formal duties back in the city. Nippon's best archer and his bow, golden fire, are still in top form. Here, Poochie, why not have a bite to eat and relax a bit? Thank you. Oh, you got it. See that fruit hanging out of the tree over that little island? That's what I'm aiming for. Going right back to basics. But the fruit's as hard as stone. Nothing damages it, even if I hit it dead center a hundred times. It sounds strange, but that's what makes it a good target. Come here, Poochie. Wanna have a bite to eat and relax a bit? Okay. Um, hmm. All right, well, I guess we're doing this now. Aha! Ah, this garden itself is just bursting with blossom. Seems to be starting to bear fruit! Of course, it's not ripe yet, so you better keep your furry paws off. Oh, yeah. Yosh! I said Yosh! I said Yosh Alright, uh well that looks important so we're going there. Uh, 
the hell is that sound? Hello? What the? Well, fuck you too. people like that? Hey, who's that? Good time to get bored of playing with them now. Come on, let's go play somewhere else. Yeah, let's go play. Fuck off. What do you think those little brats were talking about, Amy? What did they mean by a castle at the bottom of the sea? Hey, kid, how, how long do you plan on staying like that? Hey, I'm talking to you. What's wrong, kid? Uh, I must have dozed off. I reckon I do that a lot on the beach. Okay. I don't know who y'all are, but I sure appreciate you waking me up. When I ain't got the strength to go home sometimes in that year. You were sleeping? Ah, you really had a swine had stopper looking like that. You're not sick or injured, are ya? No, oh, sir. I'm as fit as a fiddle I am. Just take the... Taking a nap on the beach is all. Oh, well, that's a relief. And anyway... What was that about a castle at the bottom of the sea? Would you mind filling us in? Uh, no one ever believes me about that. There's a land under the sea here in Ryoshima. The Dragonians and Sea God live there in the Dragon Palace. The Dragonian Palace is an amazing place, real pretty. I've been there in the dog's age, though. Dragon Palace? What? What? The other one's controlling the water dragon! He make us into! So just how does one that get down to that place, bucket boy? How could a chubby, I mean, big boned lad like you elude that water dragon? Make it all the way down to the bottom of the sea. The water dragon was much nicer in those days. But you can't just choose to go to the Dragon Palace, see? Only worthy people can go. If you're worthy, an emissary called Orca comes to get you. So this Orca dude is an emissary from the Dragon Palace? And just how do you meet this guy anyway? No, that's one question that I ain't so easy to answer. Y'all see the pier over yonder? <clears throat> that pier is where I met Orca. I was looking at the sea when he came with the morning sun. Orca only comes if you're worthy of the Dragon Palace, I reckon. Got it. Where the hell's that pier? 
I reckon. Nope. Fuck. I'll play your game, you rogue. Shibu. <clears throat> and then we summon the sun. Orca! Hello. Hello. Something's coming! It's beautiful. Why does this big fish look so happy? It's kind of creeping me out. Uh -huh. Orca! Orca, it's you! It's been a dog's age! I stopped counting the years! Did you come to take me back to the Dragon Palace? or whatever of the Dragon Palace. Dragon Palace Emissary Orca. At least one worthy of visiting the dragon. No. At last! No. Yeah. Yeah, yeet! At last! One worthy of visiting the Dragon Palace! Hop on! I'll take you to the Dragon Palace! Hear that, Emmy? I'm sick of to none when it comes to swimming. Even that water dragon's no match for me. You heard him! What are we gonna do, Emmy? Oh, I, I guess you already made your, uh, your mind. Right on, Orca. Oh, hell yeah. No, no, I'm sorry. Don't loot the Orca, please! I'm second to none when it comes to swimming. That water dragon, no, meant for me. Hey, that have you believe him? What? You must complete the final ordeal decreed by Otohimi. Only then will you be worthy of visiting the Dragon Palace. Hear that, Emmy? Hey, Orca, is this Otohimi chick your boss or something? She's got a lot, lot of nerve letting that water dragon run amok. Listen, Orca, we want to ride down to the Dragon Palace. So let's hear about that ordeal you were talking about. Enter to the Dragon Palace is a whirlpool, but it's hidden right now to keep out the evil beings that plague this area. You must find the whirlpool amid this vast sea, as the ordeal decreed by Otohime. Hear that, Emmy? Sounds like a piece of cake. I mean, the sea's packed with big, with blazes begging to be explored. We'll just have to check them out till we find that whirlpool.
All right. Yaga. Oh, Creestail. No, not there, you dimwit. There we go. Yo. Yosh. Take my money! <laughs> Alright, well, thank you. I leave now. Now take me to the fish. Oh, Jesus, age balls. Fuck it, we haven't had a fight in a while. Let's go. Shit, hi. Kill it? Oh, we did. Cool. Heal me now. Thank you.
Alright, I'm guessing it's over at the, uh, you know, that. All right, we will be back. Cat Call Tower? That sounds, uh... Lewd. Wow. Mm, sounds like that annoying meow is coming from on top of this tower. Look at this paw prints on the wall. Isn't that the mark of the catwalk? Mark of catwalk? It's one of the 13 celestial brush techniques. Wait, maybe that means... Whoa! Death! Death cat! Oh shit! Whoa! Elemental cats! Yes. Yes. The boy. Ooh. 
Wow, this is high. So, wonder what ability we're going to unlock from this tower, huh? I wonder. I fucking wonder. I got a cat statue. I mean, look, there's a kitty over there. I don't know what it's doing all alone up here. Couldn't have climbed up all the way by itself, could it? Surely there couldn't be anything to eat all the way up here. I will give you fish. It stopped meowing. Mm, a constellation here? Okay. Terasu, origin of all that is good and mother to us all. The swirling whirlpool of evil below has driven me to this height. For that from this perch I observe the world below in its descent. If my power is needed once again, I, Kabigami, god of walls, shall gladly offer a bridge of a hope. <laughs> 
to the realm below. Alright, it's my headcanon, their boyfriend and girlfriend. Hey, I'm not your personal toy to be played with like that! Wait a sec. It must have been Kapigami, etc., etc. Yeah, now we can use those. Well, now we can climb on walls. Let's go find this fucking dragon city, and then we will call it. Descend it back. All right, let's see. It's not what I meant to happen, but okay. No, it's in the ocean, so. Alright, well, I think I'm gonna call this episode here and we'll pick this up next time. 
it's been a fun return.